I used to be allergic to my cat until I did this. All I do is put egg white powder into the food. Nice. So when I Googled this, it's 93% effective or something like that. I've talked to some vets about it. I don't need to go the route of getting really expensive food. And I can go a natural way. You won't find a link because I'm not really selling you. You can get it wherever you want. But I hope this helps somebody as it did for me. Hi, my name is Dr. Rubin. I'm a board certified allergist immunologist. This specific situation is unique to my specialty that I'm happy to go over in more detail. And if you want to learn more about allergies, asthma, and immunology, feel free to hit that follow button to learn more. The vast majority of people who are allergic to cats are allergic to one particular protein that is mainly found in cat's saliva, skin cells, and urine called FEL-D1, which is shorthand for Felis domesticus 1. This was the first protein discovered by scientists that could create allergy symptoms in humans. And scientists later figured out that when chickens are exposed to cats on a regular basis, they produce a protein called IgY antibodies. These are proteins that can specifically bind to FEL-D1 cat allergy proteins protein that could essentially neutralize it. This protein is passively transferred into egg yolk. That process is similar to how humans transfer IgG antibodies into the developing baby through the placenta to help protect babies for the first six months of life from infections. Purina has developed a cat allergy friendly food called ProPlan Live Clear that utilizes this mechanism. So they do have some egg proteins in the food. And what they have shown is, is that when cats are eating this food regularly every day for four weeks, when you measure the amount of Feldy one cat allergy protein in their saliva, it's reduced by close to 50%. The problem with the DIY approach is, is that you don't know that the egg proteins that you're getting are from chickens that are regularly exposed to cats. So it's possible that you may get mixed results if you're going to take that DIY approach, but there is some science behind doing something like this to help with your cat allergies. Let me know what you think about this information in the comments section. Share this information widely and follow to learn more information.